Hello everyone, my name is Gun52 and I'm here with another Minecraft Basics. Now, this one is going to be over villagers and how trading works with them. First things off, to trade with villagers you need a villager. Villagers spawn in villages, kind of, kind of obvious. These guys are, these guys tend to die a lot so protecting them is important if you want to trade with them often. And also, they apparently have no problems um, doing it when being watched by others. And I feel bad, kind of bad for these guys. Some of them are just third wheels, and it's just, just awkward. But anyways, back to trading. First thing when it comes to the villagers, you can see that some of them are wearing different kind of clothes. There are several different types of villagers. You got just the regular farmer, farmer guy right there. Blacksmith has the black um, apron. Sh um, I think that's sh Butcher. Butcher has the um, white apron. That's a priest. And a librarian's wearing white and a priest wearing red. Or pink, red, purple? I don't know. I don't know what color that is. But anyways, trading with villagers, as you can see, it t they take an input and give you another input, an output. Uh, I don't know. What so this guy wants coal for emeralds because he's a what? You're not a blacksmith. Um, okay, so I guess butchers like coal. These guys will give you a certain amount of things. Oh, that's a ripoff. That is... No. But anyways, blacksmiths give you ore-related stuff. Um, they can also give you chain mail. Uh, what is it? This guy, priest, gives you chain stuff. Stuff like that. Blarians give you clocks. They also do paper trades, which is important to note. So, trading, it's pretty simple. You just walk up to him. See, he wants one emerald for ten arrows. T ah, one emerald for ten arrows. So I'm just going to come out here. I'm going to pull out an emerald. And I'm just going to trade with him. When I put it in here, you'll notice that this pops up. And I can just pull this into my inventory. And now I have ten arrows. But when it's two things like this, you need both of those things. So let's get three emeralds here, and iron pickaxe, go up to him, let's trade. Now we need, notice we need to put both of them in to get the silk touch iron pickaxe, which is actually amazing. Now notice there's arrows here, and once you do a certain amount of trades with this, this trade will lock, and you have to go to different arrows to trade again. So let's just trade this guy out, and I'll show you that. Let's just, let's see how many times he can trade. Oh, damn. Oh, there we go. See how it, I try to pick it up, but it won't let me. How the emeralds are just flickering back and forth every time. And then the arrow opens, so I can just take these out, go to the arrow, and I have a new trade. You noticed I can't do this one again for a little bit. I could do it again later if I waited some time, but I can't do it again right now. And so I now have a second trade with this guy. That's nice. And villager trading is is useful. It is the only way to get potions of enchanting. Uh oh. It's the only way to get potions of enchanting legit in um survival Minecraft. It's also a good way to get chainmail armor. Chainmail armor is pretty cool. That's uh I still can't believe how much of a rip that oh rip off that is. Chainmail armor is pretty awesome. It's gonna holy de boop. You had a lot of leather on you, didn't you? Yep. Villagers trading. Trading's useful for getting stuff that you can't normally get. They only spawn in villages, so it's just protecting them whenever you find them. And also, they have no problem doing it in front of your eyes so if you're below the age of 18 please please use the censored version of minecraft i guess i don't know it's a very dirty game that guy has a baby and that's pretty much all i have for you for the minecraft basics also there's some escapees in here earlier I guess, I guess they're gone now that's all i have for minecraft basics of trading 
there wasn't much to really go over that I could find besides but if you have any other suggestions of what I can do or any other ideas please let me know please rate comment and subscribe and I'm sorry this is late but I hope to see you guys again in the right time later